This week in green, Motor City is about to get supercharged. Electrion, a Israeli startup, is working on a one mile stretch of road in Detroit, Michigan, that will be able to charge electric vehicles as they drive across the pavement or even during stops on the road. But how is this possible, you might be wondering. In a process similar to how wireless charging pads work, on our cell phones, Electrion has created a pavement with embedded specialized coils that send magnetic frequencies to a charging pad underneath the car. The company says that the coils do nothing to harm gas-powered vehicles. Electrion believes that the current method of plugging in your car and waiting at a charging station is inefficient and requires a new approach so that drivers of the future can charge as they go. This technology will be able to charge any electric vehicle, including buses, and is scheduled to debut in 2023. Electrion has tested this tech in Italy, Germany, and Sweden. As a side note, near collisions on this road will be now be referred to as electric slides, and if drivers find themselves stranded on the side of the road, they can phone AAA, AA, 9 volt, and D for service. That's fantastic, Jacob, that they're providing that, that, that wonderful service. Thank it's you. not just AAA. It's not. It's, it's a, that it's also AA 9 volt and indeed that, that's, that's yeah, yeah. I think it's all the batteries. I think any kind of battery that you got in your car, they'll come by. They'll come and they'll just pop it right in, no big deal. Even those ones that are like C9674212. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Those those guys, they're harder to get. <laughs> When's uh, the last time you did an electric slide? Uh, it's been ages, but I, you know what? It reminds me that I need to electric slide immediately. I think that you've been I think we've all been suffering because uh -huh. you haven't been electric mm -hmm. Sliding enough. Uh, yeah. That's an important, important point to go. The but, world needs me now more absolutely. than ever. <laughs> it's, it's fascinating story, though, Isn't that right? Cool? I mean, it's kind of cool the technology that's coming out and what, what they're up to next. Um, the first instinct that, that, that comes into my head is what are the moms going to say? Because I remember how much time it, it took and how many different videos it took just to, to convince that the Wi Fi signals were, were you know, really no big deal. That's right. That's, that's totally right. fine. Yes. Uh, I mean, now that, now that we've actually got charging coming from the road into the battery directly. I mean, what's that, yeah. are, are we gonna start being, are we gonna be worried about our bums? I know, I know, does about, it charge your bum? About our babies in the back seats of the cars? Are they yeah. being charged too? Yes, I know, I know that'll be one of the conversations is had about Electrion and what they're doing and why they're testing. So mm -hmm. I'm sure that'll come out, but you're right. People tend to look at that and they, they get worried about these things, these frequencies. You know, we have those, those wireless charging pads in our home, but if you were to supersize one and make it the size of a one mile road, right. you know, what is that gonna I do? I put my phone on it, I don't sit on it. <laughs> So that being said, I've done absolutely no research, so I'm sure yeah. it's perfectly safe. Yeah, yeah. Well, so and, you know, it's, no it's cool that it's happening in Motor City. Yeah. Uh, I think it's cool that, uh, you know, Detroit is a place that could use uh, revitalizing and bring the, the, the glory days of its uh, electric youth back. Yeah. Um, but uh, Electric Youth. That sounds like a really good band that used it? to play in the 90s. Electric Youth. And uh, now they're retired, but they occasionally come out of retirement so they can just, you know, throw you a, yeah. like, a like a heavy metal version of, of alternative rock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. A heavy metal uh, version of alternative rock mm -hmm. with a hip-hop twist and jazz fusion. Without the jazz fusion, you cannot do the electric <laughs> slide. The and why are we even bothering? Fusion. Well, a couple of talking points yeah, uh, about it. Yeah. Okay. So, additionally, in this area, we've got uh, Spark Charge, a Massachusetts startup, has developed a portable electric vehicle charger that fits inside the trunk of a car and Very can cool. give you a full charge. And they offer, as an additional service, they have an employee who will drive out to you and tra charge it if it's not fully charged or whatever. So, this is like people are coming up with these new creative ways of, yeah. you know, we've talked about before on the podcast of the charging and sitting there and plugging in and waiting. And how if we're going to be able to travel across country, there needs to be better solutions that people can do this technology. Outside of that, of course, we need to figure out something that's going to handle all the batteries and yeah. the recycled waste. But I still thought yeah. that was cool. And then, oh, it's cool. We got to get there. Yeah. One yeah. step at a time, baby. Yeah. And then the last point was U.S. automakers are expected to sell 6.9 million electric vehicles by 2025, up from the forecasted 1.4 million in 2020. So that number just keeps going That's up. That's incredible. Up yeah, fast. No, yeah. They'll all be electric soon. Yeah, yeah. We'll have more for you soon.